Who's on deck? Who wants to step up and share their mark? Donnie, you want to take the throw? I'll take you. Here we go. Is that what LeBron does? I think that's what he does. He does yeah. the powder, too. Yeah. yeah, that one, too. No, I was just talking to throw. Oh, the crown, okay. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, here it like goes. This. He does it like this. However you want to do it, it's your time to shine, dog. Yeah, you got the spotlight yeah, on you. Throw. Ladies and gentlemen, here goes Donnie's Mock Draft 1.0, made on Pro Football Network's Mock Draft Simulator. That's right. Uh, number one, we got Caleb Williams going to get his deep dish pizza in Chicago. Is yes, there? Why are you staring at me? <laughs> Just letting you know. <laughs> number two, I got Washington taking Drake May. I think it's a mistake, but that's what Washington does. Damn. Uh, not that Drake May is terrible. It's, I, I just think J, uh, uh, Jaden Daniels is a better pick, and I think that's why he'll be on the Patriots because they make the good decisions over there. Number four, we got Marv Harrison Jr. to Arizona. If he goes anywhere else earlier or later, everyone would be shocked because uh, he's been locked in Arizona for a long time now. Number five, I also got Joe Alt for the Chargers. You got a quarterback already over there. Uh, they're talking about getting rid of these. What I just like, they just lost uh, Eckler. It doesn't seem like they're trying to go all in on weapons. They just drafted a wide receiver in the first round last year, and it didn't even go very well for him. So I think they're no. just going to go into the some line. And their quarterback just got hurt. So it's like, let's protect this guy. Okay. I think six, the Giants also take a tackle. Uh, I got him at J.C. Latham. Alabama, you can't go wrong with a lineman from Alabama. And the Giants need literally everything. It looks like they're building the D-line right now. Burns, Thibodeau on the other side. Interior, you know, you were talking about the levels of building your team up. Hell yeah. Got to start there. Uh, you don't want to just – they're not getting a quarterback, I don't think, this year. So try to build that line up for when a quarterback does come, makes his life easier. Kind of like Dak Prescott effect. Uh, number seven, I got the same scenario, Titans. I got them taking a Marius Mims from Georgia. Uh, just more linemen over there. They got another running back. They got a two running back system, it looks like, again. Yeah, Tony Pollard. They're probably just going to be running until, like, they got Will Levis. I don't think he's the answer over there, but we'll see. build your lineup. Uh, just wait. I also have Dallas Turner going to Atlanta. I feel like he's just a, a difference offensive, maker. offensive linebacker. Yeah. Number one offensive Love. linebacker in the league. Love to see a goat. Uh, number nine, I got Malik Neighbors going to Chicago. Pair him up with uh, Caleb Williams, DJ Moore, uh, Swift over there now. That that could turn the offense into a fun fun thing all of a sudden for Chicago. Ten, I got Olamawa Fashionu. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. <laughs> yep. Uh, going to the Jets. They need to protect Aaron Rodgers at all costs. He's about 67 years old by now. Um, please watch out for his legs and everything. Please take care of him. <laughs> for love of God. <laughs> Please. Can, we, can, can we let him play more than four snaps this yeah, year? Yeah, can we get 17 games this year? Jeez. Oh, um, Dave Bakhtiari, speaking of which. Oh, yeah. Packers cut him. So maybe. I can see Jets him heading over there. Up. Those are their boys, too. Yeah. Yeah. Number 11, Minnesota. I got J.J. McCarthy going over there. This feels like Kenny Pickett 2.0. Uh, just taking the scraps of whatever's left at running back. and Or not running back, quarterback. And you're taking J.J. McCarthy. And I I just think he's going to stink. But Damn. Say it's an easy guy. Sorry about it. Go blue. <laughs> Number Fuck. 12. Fuck blue. I think uh, I got Denver <laughs> taking Jared Verse. Edge seems good for Denver. I don't really know what they're trying to do right now. It seems like. No one knows. It's very, it's very interesting because, like, I could see them taking a quarterback in the first round, but also with Sean Payton, I could see them maybe getting, like, I don't know, like, go like a de defensive player yeah, or something. They could literally take anybody. Yeah, so interesting. Like, okay, Fields. Sean Payton, that makes Fields, sense. Fields could work over there. You never know, bro. Right? I don't know. He doesn't seem like – if Russ wasn't a Sean Payton guy, I just don't see Fields being it either. He might be, though. I don't know. Fields don't know. is cool, though. You got to think, Sean Payton, Drew Brees, he's, I think he still has that in his mind, pocket passing quarterback, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. Well, we will see. I don't know. They got a – they're running out of options, too, it looks like, so I don't even know. Yeah, it's a yeah. brand new league. There's not many of those left. Joey Flacco. Yeah, easy peasy. Jeez. <laughs> Especially in that Come back Denver player era. of the year. Come on. Throwing 90 yards in that Denver air. Come on. Uh, number 13, we got uh, Quinion Mitchell yep. from Toledo. Cornerback uh, for the Raiders. Seemed like a good fit. Uh, 14, Talese Fawaga, a tackle for the Saints. That's another team that looks hopeless. Um, they have so many cap troubles. They're only able to pick at all the way down to 14 because they win enough games to get a bad pick and lose enough games that they don't matter. Uh, they're stuck with Derek Carr right now. That whole division, I think, is just like doo-doo quarterback after doo-doo quarterback. It's just me. So, yeah. Jeez. So I see, you know, take a tackle, build your line, wait till next year. Hopefully, stink harder, and get a quarterback. Uh, Shador, 15. 
Uh, here's your Colts. I got them taking Terry on Arnold, the cornerback from Alabama. Hey, I would, I would, I would love this. Yeah, I go lie Don't to you. Need a corner. Yeah, you know, he's a stand-up guy. Loves his mama. Takes care of his mama. As uh, we, we would, like we, we would love a guy like that. Okay. Lockdown yep. corner too. Let's not forget that. That's essential. You can't forget about that. You can't forget about that. 16, I got uh, Seattle taking Jackson Powers Johnson, center out of Oregon. I think uh, they're trying to run the ball. They got Ken Walker over there. They got uh, Charbonnet last nope. year. And a, a nice center to help build off that offensive line, make it easier for Geno Smith in his last couple years. 17, I think this is crazy. I don't know if he can actually fall this far down, but I was like, got to do it. Jaguars, which I was saying earlier, are like top of my hate list of teams. Um, Romo Duze, they could use Romo Duze real bad. Watch 18. <laughs> I got the Bengals taking Brock Bowers. This All these is top crazy. teams. Huh? They used to fall on this low? Yeah. I got the Bengals taking them. They, uh, they're, T. Higgins just asked for a trade, so they're big, large body receivers trying to get out of there. Why not replace them with a new weapon for uh, yeah. Joe Burrow? Get him a tight end. Yeah. All the, the other top quarterbacks have good tight ends, so why not give one to Burrow? 19, I got Byron Murphy, the second, going to the Rams. Number 20, I got Troy Fontenot, tackle for the Steelers. Build up that line because you're still just getting more rental quarterbacks than Russ. Uh, help them out, maybe. Let's do 21, I got the Dolphins taking Jerzon Newton. Johnny, dude. Johnny. Johnny Newton. Uh, he wants to be called Johnny. Okay. Johnny football. Johnny on the spot. That's right. Uh, they just lost uh, Wilkins. Yeah, so they need to replace something over there. Number 22, we got Kool-Aid McKinstry, cornerback out of Alabama. Their D-backs were terrible this year. It was the thing. It was the theme of the Eagles ever since they were 10-1 and one and started losing over and over again. Everyone was like, oh, their D-backs are terrible. They're trash. They're losing it. So, yeah, they need to get some corners over there. 23, I got another edge going to the Texans. Last year, they were standing on business, traded up to get that pick to get Will Anderson. I think it would be a good idea to add some more uh, offensive power for Stroud, but with a defensive coach, I'm not surprised if they take a, a defensive player like Latu Latu. 24, I think this pick doesn't make too much sense. Uh <laughs> And that's Fuck it, we just did it anyway. Uh, they're going to take Brian Thomas Jr. I think it's what? It's a good pick. Pair him up with CeeDee Lamb is dangerous. It's like going back to Amari Cooper and CeeDee Lamb. Yeah. But um, I don't fans, think it's what Dallas needs. Bills fans will be sick. Yeah, they will. <laughs> and I will too. And that's just the way it is. Oh, they said, you know what? This is what you get for getting Dalton Kincaid. Yeah. yeah. 25. I think in uh, Giants fashion, they'll take a boring pick like Graham Barton from Duke. <laughs> uh, they need him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they need everything bad. No disrespect, Graham. They just got a new running back. Uh, no. Singletary. No. Giants? Giants. Oh, not the Giants. I meant oh. the Packers. Oh, my bad. My bad. I saw the G and I said Giants, maybe. So I, I meant Packers. <laughs> uh, 25. Packers <laughs> take. I was going to say, bro. Graham Barton. <laughs> no, the Giants ain't picking at 25. Uh, They're okay. way up higher. So, so the Packers still going to take a boring pick, I guess. Yeah, no, that's the Packers way. They just got Josh Jacobs. Why not pound at the rock a little bit? 26. I got Nate Wiggins going to the Bucks. We had uh, Cardinals. The Cardinals are up again. Take Tyler Guy in. Tackle out of Oklahoma. Help protect Kyler. 28. I got the Bills taking Peyton. The Bills. Buffalo Bills. Uh, we all want them to take a wide receiver, and that's why they're going to take a linebacker. <laughs> Peyton yeah. Wilson out of North Carolina State. <laughs> Yo, but potentially the best linebacker in this draft they're saying. They're saying he, the quote I saw was, Peyton Wilson is a maniac on the field. His comp was Luke. That seems like. Yeah. Uh, what's, what? Are you all right? Huh? What's his name? Who? McDermott's kind of okay. guy. <laughs> I was about to say McDuffie. So yeah, hard. he's uh, you're just joking. He's dude. a former wrestler, so <laughs> is that, that lines Duke? up with McDermott? Peyton Wilson is. Yes. Mm, Yo, his on. his comp was Luke Keekley. Panther, former Panther dog. And McDermott I could used to be. Panther. Now that you're saying it, bro. Milano's made of glass. Now I can see it. I'm just saying, it seems like that's what? what's gonna happen. Glass. It's like his first injury, isn't it? I don't think so. No, last season, too. Yeah. Oh. We need a guy. Oh, yeah, that's right, because Josh fucked me out of the Trap Nerd Trophy. That's right. Wait. Oh. But he didn't get hurt that game, but still, regardless, he fucked me out of the trophy. <laughs> yeah, he did. Number 29, Lions! Kay. Lions! Taking uh, Cooper DeJean out of Iowa. Okay. Uh, Dijon Mustard. 30, Baltimore taking Troy Franklin. Big Troy. body wide receiver out of Oregon. 31. We 31. Got Lad McConkey going to San Francisco. Light and then McConkey. 32, I got Chris Broswell out of Alabama going to the Chiefs. Great, because that's what we need. We're going to see that with anyone Chiefs get. That's what I'm saying, because, I mean, like, they we'll got the like, 30 oh, second spot, but, like. Again. They're going to steal somebody somehow, some way. 
And they, but, they're, oh, of course, they've been hitting with their draft picks. Yeah, bro. they have. Did we make your team better? Did we make your team worse? You tell us in the comments section here. If you want to make your own mock draft, forget that other mock draft simulator. They make you pay to trade. What kind of ridiculousness is that? That's a BS. You know what? You have to pay to mock. Yeah. yeah. Who wants to do that? It's fucked up, isn't it? So that's why I'm going to go Pro Football Network with their free trades free? on their mock draft simulator. I would go nowhere else but PFN. So with that being said, scan the QR code. Go create your own mock draft for free trades. And once you're done with that mock, share it with us on all of our social platforms. Head over to Twitter. Tag us at TankTalk underscore pod. Also tag PFN365 with hashtag PFNMDS.